We are still hanging out at the 2014 drop zone for Easter Seal Saskatchewan. Right now, I'm joined by Rochelle, who is a camp mother of a very lovely 14-year-old girl named Aaliyah, who attends camp each summer. Now, Rochelle, tell me, what has your experience been with Easter Seal Saskatchewan? Well, you know, Camp Easter Seal is just an amazing place, and you really have to go and experience it to see what it's about. But the amazing thing is that these kids that day to day maybe stand out from their peers because they're different, there they go and they're the norm. And, you know, everything that they do, it's just a lot of fun that kids that, you know, may get to experience camp all the time, yes. uh, take for granted, and they get to go there and just be a kid and hang Absolutely. out. Yeah, Add a little normalcy to their life, which is amazing. And every kid deserves, and that's why you're here today. You're gonna be rappelling now. Is this your first time rappelling? This is my first. And how are you feeling right now? A little nervous when I look up, but <laughs> hopefully I'll be okay. Now, Rochelle, tell me a little bit. A day in the life of Rochelle and Aaliyah must be a bit hard at times. How has Camp Easter Seal or Easter Seal Saskatchewan helped Aaliyah and your family? Well, I think, you know, it's it's a break for the families as well as it is for the kids. It's a break from their therapies and appointments and just to get away from, from everything that they have to do on a day-to-day -day basis, or most of it anyways. Um, and for the families, it's for many families, it's much-needed respite that they otherwise wouldn't have. And it's a neat thing, too, because some of those families will camp in Watrous and kind of get together and form their, form their own little support group or network and have a good time together together too because they share a lot of the same issues so it's a great benefit for them that way as well. Yeah and what is one of the major things that you've seen how Aaliyah's life has changed since she started with Easter Seal Saskatchewan? Well I, I think the first year that we sent Aaliyah we weren't sure she would make the five days by herself. She hadn't been away from us that long and my husband was pretty certain she'd be you know calling us to come pick her up yeah. but at the end of five days she had almost um, she'd gained so much confidence Aww. and um, really became more independent and our two and a half hour trip home she talked non-stop about all the wonderful things that they did and you know I still hear stories that are I hadn't heard yet um, that had happened at camp and they do do some wacky things and you know just fun stuff and yeah. so I think you know it really helps those kids to get a little separation from their parents and gain some independence but you know some of the highlights for Leah she said um, that blindfolded makeovers so they you know blindfolded each other did makeovers and she giggled and laughed about that for a, a long Long time but I think if you talk to the kids their highlight is probably pranking each other's cabins which you know it's gonna happen at any camp and that's awesome that's great well thank you so much for talking to us I know we were mentioning a little earlier it's a bit emotional here because lots of people have such close ties to the uh, the cause and just drop zones so thank you so much Rochelle I can't wait to see you repel yeah, thank you <laughs>